Hi. <laughs> a little cool. Right. More plates on. Right, as you can see by Alex, it's been a long day. Got off to a really poor start. It's just threw the whole day out. Right, Dad's getting the last mix in for the day. We're uh, we're now up to lentil height. We've uh, just got the blocks in. Bricks have been in for a bit now. Insulation's in. Just for everyone out there, their wires are in. So um, so the next step now is getting the lentil in, getting the commons and the wall plate on. Then that's the front done with. Then Dad's gonna get the last pike in while I tidy up. So, uh, yeah, it's been a long day. We're not even gonna check the time. We already know it's late. And it's gonna be late because we haven't even started this uh, bloody pike yet. So let's get on it. Hi. <laughs> uh, we're gonna be uh, since we're in the middle of a. Uh, Getting all this done, we're going to set up a uh, we're going to set up a lintel. So um, yeah, let's uh, let's get this in and show you what we need. Okay, fire away. So just say a bit of a bed on the back, a bit of a bed on the front. Yeah. Thin bed. Very thin bed. Just enough to stop it moving. These bricks dry out quick. So you don't put a lot. Of, you don't put a lot on just so um, you're not raising your brickwork, then making it hard to tap down on the lintel, which you don't want to do. There you go. Thank you. Let's hope I've took out enough. Nice and light as well. Yeah. Just slide that in here, yeah. Now forget the front. Alex, oh, forget the front. We're working on the back. Working on the back? Yeah. There we go. One lint installed over a door. Uh, now all we need to do is... Oh yeah, you've got to allow 150 seat in. Now all we've got to do is bring the brickwork over and then our wall plate and then this is a bit short at the front but it's, an e it's like an eaves lintel it doesn't matter there's going to be a fascia board comes on the front here so um, yeah let's um, get that brickwork done <laughs> Right, 
Wall plate's on. It's actually uh, a bit short here, but I think you even up when, when it's gone off. The bed isn't made, isn't to stick it down, the bed's purely to level it. Because it gets fixed in, strapped in, so it can be moved once the bed's gone off. Oh. I'm paralleled it, it's 11.90 down that end, so that's 11.85. So we need to tap it down, tap it down and back a bit. Video would be a nice reaction video about two o'clock in the afternoon. Yeah, so okay, so today we're using Keystone SK90 90 for 90 mil for 100 mil cavity. We're still on 100 mil cavities up north. So I'm going to bed this on. You don't need a massive bed, if you put a massive bed on, then you won't end up with a bed on top of the link. Put them up on the bricks last because it goes off very quick. Just a smidge. Just enough to key the link back to brickwork. on to make sure you've got your, your gap. So that's flush there. Put the back. That block work over. You can actually go back a bit that. Same there. Yep. Now limp uh, level please mate. I've got it. Okay, so it wants to go down this end. So we're now ready to go over the brickwork and the uh, first things first is the cavity tray. I don't know if this is what work first. Doesn't well, matter does it? Doesn't really matter does it? No. It would be built into the back wouldn't it? Yeah. So okay so now it's our cavity tray which I think Alice has already cut. Lintel's installed, cavity tray is in position, upstand on the end for our first vent and then an upstand at this end for that pert there. There we go. So now it's just getting me my water. Um, so first vent there, other vent there and then space them out evenly. I think um, every two bricks, yeah because we're not putting soldiers in so it's every 450. Because we're putting straight brick work over the top. So yeah, um, let's get this first course down. There's paint going in.
matter if your bed's over lintel either. tapping on the lintel either because um, it will just cause vibration and make the rest of your bricks sink. There we have it. One upstand at the end, tray in, another upstand here, ready for our last tent. Put that in place, get this last brick in. So there we have it, wheat vent, two brick, wheat vent, two brick, and then one brick in the middle. So anyway, we can make it work. It should be every two, but let's see. Every two, every two, and then every one, just 
just keeps it tidy so that's the installation of the lintel I'll show you a bit further on so we're gonna go to time lapse now and then we'll, we'll have a recap when we get back to it so As you can see by Alex, it's been a long day. Got off to a really poor start. It's just threw the whole day out. So there we go. Done. Just got to back it up now. But that's all the face work done. This scaffold can come down now. So I'm going to hop inside and get that top block pop work done. It shouldn't take long, it's only about six block. So I'm going to whip that up quick. Profile can come down now, mate. Uh, yeah, so. Pack number two done. Cavity tray included. Cavity tray. Wall plate on. With the keystone included. So what have we done today? We've done that pike. I think. Yeah, we've done that pike inside and out. We've brought this up nine courses. Eight or nine courses. Squared that up round, finished the window off, built the pike, put the lintel in, tray, vents, etc. Show you the vents, you should be able to see them up here just. There you go. Four vents in. Four. Yeah, so you can't tell on the camera, but it's actually going dark. It's, it's probably getting on for seven o'clock now, maybe even later. So, um, we're both knackered. So the plan is tomorrow I've got a pointing job in the morning, so I'll go and get my pointing job done and get back here. And then Alex's mum can ring him in and then we'll get up, get the rest of the stuff tidied up, throw in the van. First thing tomorrow we've got to empty the van, what's in there now. As you can see it's still a bomb site yet. So that got a lot of tidying up to do yet. We were hoping to get everything done today but we've just run out of light. And enthusiasm that's gone too. So um, yeah, hopefully you've liked this one. So give us a like, uh, subscribe, 
get us help us get us to twenty thousand, which we're going to do a giveaway on. We've already got a couple of prizes lined up for that, which I'm sure everybody will like. And um, yeah, hit the, hit the notification bell so you get you get notified whenever we release a video. So yeah, it's it's not the widest of extensions, but it's it's, it's, it's very long. So yeah, see you in the next one.